Today I'm going to show you how to fix the error in push signal out of range that's followed with a black screen. So the first thing you want to do is you want to power down your computer. Then once you start it, immediately after you see your boot logo, if you have a computer that's um, HP or Dell, you might see Dell logo, and immediately after you see that, you want to push the F8 button. And once you get to the screen, you want to hit Enable Low Resolution Video. Usually after you push that on Windows 7, it takes a while to boot depending on the computer you have. So I'm just going to be back after it's done booting and I happen to name my password. Okay, I am back. My computer has finished booting. And once you have booted into your Windows desktop, the first thing you want to do is you want to right click on your desktop. and push screen resolution okay so what you on your screen resolution is you want to push it back to whatever resolution you had it before and use this particle down since the resolution is so low that the windows aren't big. So if your resolution is right, you want to hit keep changes. And one thing I recommend to doing is going on the advanced settings. Go on the monitor. And if this is not already checked, and usually it is, but it isn't checked on mine, you want to check that. And so you won't be able to accidentally put it on a resolution or refresh where the click monitor can't display and that can actually cause that error. So this is how you fix the input signal on the range error with this followed with a screen.